normally we have a, a snappy sort of intro ready for you. Well, and that's I true. Think, I think that you as viewers deserve that, but God damn it, we just... We fucked up this time. I don't know what viewers deserve. I've re <laughs> you know what? I'm taking a new attitude, which is fuck the viewers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Wait. No, I'm going to be actively hostile towards them. Oh, God. Okay, great. Yeah. So I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to mediate. Oh, no. What happened to your body? Oh, this is As I Play Dying. Oh, yeah. Hi. Welcome back to it. I promise that you're welcome here, no matter what Will says. We'll uh, see. <laughs> <laughs> He's, uh... It's just, you know... It's his nature. What is? He has a he has a hard outer shell. You. Oh, an exoskeleton? Yeah. I've been possessed by a mini ghost. Oh no. God damn it. Now I have to get exercised. I hate exercise. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Put throw some shorts on, bro. Oh god, I'm just doing fucking <laughs> word association today. Yeah, it's going to be a uh, a low effort episode of as I play dying today. And lower than usual. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like subterranean. I like that the urban zombie has their own specific death dialogue. It's, it's it, it said like back to the earth. They or return something? to the dust of the earth. Oh, yeah. oh, sweet. Um, up. What does the ghost possession thing do? Um, it's just an enemy that follows you. Hey, 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 hey! Follows you around and gets a turn in combat to attack you. Oh, very nice. <laughs> These fucking buck two zombies are hilarious. Yeah, they are. Oh, uh who? -huh. They're. Well, I don't want to spoil anything, but so I won't. Okay. It's from Mother 3. Okay. The zombies in Mother 3 are made to look specifically like characters who had recently died in the storyline. Oh. And it's very fucked up, but it's a very, it's a good moment when uh -huh. you c come against them because they're like, oh God, these look like these characters that just died. Jeez. So I, lo I love the progression of your disclosure of information to like I don't want to I'm not going to spoil I don't want to spoil anything I'm not going to spoil anything here's what it is <laughs> well n what what I didn't want to spoil was the identities of the people that died and I feel like I found, oh I feel oh, like okay. I found my way around that I see gotcha now let's stop straw from dying let's pay attention to this game I mean if you think that's a good idea I don't know what's a good idea anymore. if it's a worthy course of action have eat her eat a bottle rocket <laughs> put some pep in her step <laughs> No! Tiny little ghost. <laughs> Spill a solidify. I'll slap you. Do you think you would you would freeze solid if a zombie reached out at you with an icy hand? Oh shit. No. Swill! It would probably have to make contact with me, wouldn't he? Probably, yeah. Swill's dead, though. Oh. This is why Alas, you don't... Swill, I barely knew ye. This is why you don't bring nerds out with you on an adventure. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, are you gonna tell me where we're gonna be going outside? <laughs> Alright. I want and fighting zombies! Who wants to go to the hospital? <laughs> Everybody in our fucking age group, but none of us can afford to. Yeah, that's... <laughs> okay, but I was talking to my coworker who has a wife and two kids, mm -hmm. and their insurance costs are astronomical. It's oh, of bizarre. course. bizarre. This is, by the way, the... Typical, like the archetypal structure of an As I Play Dying episode. <laughs> yeah. It's both really lowbrow word association and existential torment about like real, <laughs> real for, issues. First of all, back the fuck up about lowbrow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I love word association. I do too. We, I think that we have, I can't think of any right now, but we have really dug up some gold on this show. Yeah, I agree. Hey, this <laughs> might be an exorcist. <clears throat> you may not believe me. But I'm a healer. Let's... Would you like me to soften you? That's in case you get diamondized. <laughs> uh, okay. Purify. In case you are... Oh, I don't have any money. Polluted, I guess. I always do this. I'm sorry. I'm the worst player. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <sighs> yeah. But you're not the worst player. It's the worst system. It is not a great system. They should just put ATMs in the hospital and it would solve all these problems. Yeah, seriously. Listen, I can't defend Earthbound on some of its mechanical systems. <laughs> I gotta point out too, like I, it's, this isn't ethical that they would do it, but then they could also drive up the, uh, what is it, the withdrawal fee for the convenience, and you'd still pay it because you're not gonna walk all the way back to the hotel. Yeah, of course. So they're they're like actively throwing away money at this point. It's true. Yeah. Anyway, you're right. I've got money now. I'm just going to keep $1,000 on me because yes. I am a, I'm a 13-year-old child, and that's what you do. Yeah, exactly. You just, just put, it, put it in your sock so that nobody can find it if they try and mug you. 
I this is not the correct course of events, but we do need to go back to Lilliput Steps at some point because we didn't complete it. Oh yeah, what did we not do there? Uh, we didn't get the my sanctuary location. Oh right, we we missed a sphincter. Yeah, a twinkle spank. <laughs> I didn't want to grind <laughs> at, the, <laughs> at the time. <laughs> um, you didn't want to grind that sphincter. Yeah. So why don't we do that now? That'll get us some levels. Okay. For these people and oh hey, magic butterfly. What a wor wonderful world we live in. Aww. All right, thank you. Um, then hey, that'll get relax, that'll get us enough. Oh, that doesn't look right. We're not that supposed to be able to pitch tents here. Remember? Dingy ass circus don't you tent? remember reading? I do not. I had forgotten. Oh, you made a joke about it, but that's fine. Oh, now I remember. Yeah. So <laughs> because I, th the the exact same joke occurred to me twice. Gorg. This is no circus tent. Oh. Boogie tent. Yeah. This is not the kind of boogie tent that I want to participate in. Let's. I like don't know if, what he's if there's against. some, if there's a hopping band in there. They could be boogieing. Yeah, yeah but I could get down on that kind of boogie tent. That That's an IE. I think that the Runaway Five went to Foresight, though. Oh, that's where the boogie tents are. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's not strong against the. Oh, but I froze. These are like bogey tents. Okay. Why? Why and how distinguish between the bo boogie and bogey? Like boogeyman, bogeyman. I don't, is there a difference between those two? Things? I don't think so. I don't know why we why there are two pronunciations though. I don't either. Well, I think. Yeah, I don't know. Who knows? Who knows anything anymore? I, yeah, I, the world I, I is <laughs> unsolvable. Everything is mad. Yeah. All right, let's set this tent on fire. I feel like I should have known that without. <laughs> okay. Swill, swill. Because Jeff, it's inflammable. I guess swill is nice because he can um, he can identify enemy weak spots and oh, let you know what they are. Nice. It's probably the zipper or the seams. Oh yeah, probably. Let's do this, and then let's fire a bottle rocket into this goddamn Right tent. into your fucking face. How you like that? How's your boogie-ass face like that? He keeps defense spraying, though. <laughs> <laughs> I do that when I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> Just, uh, yeah. I spray wildly. I, um... Oh, hold on. I, I, I'm not playing this game very well, and I'm so <laughs> sorry. I'm sitting here, it's like, okay. trying to talk. You shouldn't have said anything. I never would have identified it. Yeah, but that wasn't for you. That was for... Oh, <laughs> the people who would identify it. Yes. Gotcha. Stop defending yourself, Boogie Tent. <laughs> Just let me destroy you. <laughs> Jeez. Why does this have to be so hard? Just want to set this tent on fire. Go oh God! Well, I guess we're lucky that he just keeps defending himself yeah. instead of. This, yeah, you know the tenor of this fight has really taken a turn. I'm starting to feel kind of guilty. His yeah, tent we're, just we're just keeps... beating up on a tent. Yeah, yeah, he just is trying to defend himself. And you know, even in like the initiation phase, we tried to walk into him. It's true. Yeah, but he wasn't supposed to be there. We're really just enforcing the law. Okay. Oh, okay. If you want to hide behind that. Bye, tent. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Better fucking run. A jar of fly honey. Oh, you can catch well, never mind. I guess you've already caught more flies with that. Yeah, no, I think I think that it is a play on that term, but I think it's also specifically Oh, there's no Okay, that's just garbage in there. <laughs> I think specifically it's supposed to be honey made from flies. It's just one of those weird surrealist things. Um I know, Sam. Uh uh, were you just gonna walk through this tunnel? Yeah. I thought there was there were ghosts in it. Oh, you're right. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> it's like you haven't even played this game before. No, I thought I could. If just... If you have any other questions, let me. I know. I thought I could just beat them up with my bat. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that it was an actual. Just, you fucking ghost scrub. Just progression barrier. Yeah. Oh, hey, a house. That's a tiny house. You know, I do feel bad that I didn't do the orange kid thing. Um. <laughs> Oh, Belch works for Gygus. Who's Belch again? He's the one making all the zombies here in town. Have we met him yet? No, not okay. yet. We've only heard his name whispered in hushed to wounds. <laughs> Correct. His name is actually uh, the onomatopoeia for burping um, in Japanese. Oh. I forget what it is. I oh, hold on. I'm getting a call. It's Apple <laughs> so, Kid. Oh, don't let me interrupt. Oh, we finished a unique invention. 
Oh. Zombie nice. paper. <clears throat> <clears throat> you uh, see, at least, as long as the tent isn't trying to eat you, it exactly. should work really well. <clears throat> Look, we can solve the zombie problem with zombie paper. There we go. And he's going to deliver it with a pizza delivery guy. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. The unsung heroes of our society, really. So if you had invested in Orange Kid, mm-hmm. uh, he doesn't actually give you any items at if all. If you had invested? Yeah. Okay. Because but you you did Apple Kid, not Orange Kid, right? You can do both, because Orange Kid can't help you. Um, <laughs> but you still give him money, and he calls you throughout the game with useless bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Gee, weird that you didn't want to engage with that. All right, hey Dad, let's talk to Dad. Let's save. And he's gonna go to sleep because who knows where the fuck he is. <laughs> well, we like to work hard just like your mother, but it's not good to hey. work too hard. Is she still alive? <laughs> it's funny he says it's not good to work too hard, and yet he's always gone. Yeah. I'm gonna call my takes mom, one though. to no one, Dad. Uh, and this is—I forgot to do this. This is important. <clears throat> Escargo Express. Yep. Say hi to Vanilla, Tracy. <clears throat> hi! Van- Vanilla, this is Tracy. You, this is uh... your sister? Oh, that's your sister? Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought that was why you weren't seeing your dad anymore. No. no, no. And, uh, listen, Vanilla, as usual, don't tell your mom about this. Okay, well, we can't call Escargo Express right now, but they can come and pick up your bullshit, which is nice. Oh. I'm going to take the opportunity to go to sleep as well and see if Jeff fixes any of the broken items in his inventory. What broken shit does he have? Uh, he's got uh, a broken air gun and a mm. broken iron currently. and a broken heart. But yeah, exactly. Okay. No, I think I think that's Tony, because Jeff had to leave. Oh yeah, poor yeah. Tony. Well, you know, <clears throat> at least um, the man you loved got to stand on him before he left. <laughs> <laughs> the paper is called the Zombie Herald. <laughs> Boogie tent falls. Young human to blame. <laughs> to b- okay, I don't I don't really get the way you're phrasing that. What do you mean? To blame? Yeah. Like, I, I could be credited with no, removing it, this haunted tent from your... But it's your... written from the zombie perspective. Oh, Hey, it's okay. the mock pizza guy. While delivering pizza, it is where the guy asked me to help him out. He wanted me to deliver this to someone named the Vanille, who's wandering around Threed. No one else knows about this, right? Let's just pretend that you're Vanille, and I'll give this to you. Oh, hello, Vanille. <laughs> Just go along with me on this one, okay? I made the decision that you're Vanille, no matter what. <laughs> All right. Bye, Mock Pizza. <laughs> That's right, Vanille. <laughs> I've done a my duty and given you <laughs> Apple Kids a thing in my jig. Well, goodbye. And say, Fuzzy Pickles. <laughs> <laughs> that would... Fuzzy Pickles is probably like the... The Illuminati code word of the... Probably, yeah. <laughs> there's, the secret string pullers of this world. There's a photo feature in Final Fantasy XV that's really cool, too. One mm-hmm. of your party members takes photos, and every time you camp, you can look over the things that he shot from your adventure. Oh, yeah. It's a really cool... It's just fucking Coleman logos. Yeah, exactly. Prompto. A, what are it, you doing? It's a fucking... really cool system, though. I like it. Um, and there's one where you can pose for a photo, and he asks you to save, save Fuzzy Pickles. <laughs> Nice. Made me happy, yeah. That's funny. <laughs> well, I can do whatever I want. We just, just have to save his life. Wow. Okay. All right. Oh, right. This is the tent um, that we're going to... We're going to trap all the zombies in here, mm-hmm. and then we're going to burn it to the ground. <laughs> <clears throat> They're going to have to stay in there, right? Uh, yes, like, exactly. Just, just think. You'll be saving the town. So first, let's just put down the zombie paper. Got to make that zombie paper, bro. <laughs> <clears throat> Um, I think I might just sleep now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think now... We'll Outside just... the tent is my recommendation. Yeah, we'll sleep, and then all the zombies are gonna... Oh, there's a fucking trick-or-treat kid. Let's bash his uh. face in. <laughs> hey, kid, it's not Halloween. Yeah, you motherfucker, look at a calendar. All right, he's just a trick-or-treat kid. Fuck this guy. It's just tricks. Ah. Oh. He's not interested in any that treats. Is, no, yeah, you don't even... Even my treats mean nothing to you. That is bullshit. You're just an agent of chaos, trick-or-trick kid. Well, you know what? Your paper... Your toilet paper <laughs> is not making it into my trees this year. I... Little bastard. fucking hate pranks. Can I talk about this? Have we talked about this on the show? Uh, not on the show, I don't think. God. I am aware of your... Your distaste for pranks. So when I was a kid, I would never prank anyone. Because mm-hmm. pranking is just... It, it's a thing. We, like, you do it and then it retaliates... And then it never ends. It's yeah. just constant progression it's and retaliation. <laughs> the cycle of violence. And I don't like it. 
Um, so I would never prank anyone back, but people would prank me. And I'm just like, fuck, now I got to clean this up. And I'm not going to get you back. So you just won. You got off scot-free. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, yeah, that's uh, that, that, that does suck. Yeah, I hate that bullshit. Don't prank me. Yeah. It's, no, don't work. Mm-hmm. You weren't going to go in the, the hall closet, were you? I might. What's in there? Nothing's in the hall closet. <clears throat> Certainly nothing you need to access. Why don't you just... I, I will go in the hall closet. I'm still the boogie tent. Falling. Just in case there was any sort of, I don't know, trap in there. What sort of, what sort of trap did you set up? There so? isn't a trap in the hall closet, so there's no reason to but worry about it. But if there were a trap, what type of trap would you have set up? It wouldn't be a spring-loaded net. What were you going to do with be. a net? I t- whatever I wanted. <clears throat> like what? Wait, what? <laughs> well, no, I was... Ca- <laughs> okay, there's only one thing you do with a net. Yeah, you catch someone. Yeah. But That's what, what I would do with a net. What do you do after I'm caught? Whatever I wanted. I don't like that. Well, it's not important because there obviously isn't a net in the hall closet, so <clears throat> you should stop fucking dwelling on it, <clears throat> weirdo. Okay. Zombie paper really works. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, look at the guy. Uh, He's a fucking meathead. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> no, poor dead zombie. You humans are such cowards. All right. Fuck these people. <laughs> if I try to get away, my body will just fall apart. I wonder if anyone here is selling bottle rockets. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's the guy. You trying to find out how to burn the tent down? No. Oh. I just need bottle rockets. <clears throat> rust promoter? Yeah. It promotes rust. Yo, motherfuckers, Rust about to drop the hottest album of the summer. <laughs> it's not a... I don't think it's that <laughs> oh, type okay. of promotion. <laughs> Oh, let's get him a toy air gun, too. That'll make him stronger. Here, kid, have some firearms. Uh, yeah, and here, here's a stun gun. Well, yeah, that's, no that's, problem. That's why he's a, a guy in camouflage hanging out behind a pizza place. Good like, point, yeah. A, I just need to fill up on bottle rockets. He and, looks like, um... What's the fucking guy's name from Kill a Kill? The, uh... The nudist beast, the nudist beach agent. Oh, uh, with, with the mohawk. Fuck. What yeah. is his name? I love that guy. Yeah, he's great. <laughs> his character design is awesome too. Yeah. I guess the director of Kill a Kill has a new anime that came out. <gasps> really? Yeah. What is it? Do you know? I forget what it's called. It's not one of the My Hero ones, is it? No. Okay. It is like, uh, Space Patrol Lulu Co or something like that. Well, it's, it's supposed to be real short. I have something to do. Yeah, I haven't seen it or heard much about it. But oh, oh okay. fucking shit! Hey, guess what? <laughs> the no good fly and its cohorts. Oh god, that thing in the background is just—it's so a putrid, disgusting. moldy man. Yeah, I know, but oh, <laughs> I, I never get used to just how putrid and moldy a man he is. I love putrid, moldy man. <laughs> Look at that fucking—he looks like a like a down and out Sesame Street character. Yeah, that's why I love him. Yeah, I'm like yeah. <laughs> oh, Swill, stay alive. Uh, yeah, nobody wants to hang out with the you know, the no good Piotr Moldy man, eh? <laughs> ah, fuck you all. Eat some butts. Ah. <laughs> Eat some butts. <laughs> I know, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> he just wants to be famous. I think your mom texted me that at one point. Oh, really? That, yeah. That the Indy fucking... Just, Indy just wants to be famous. The fame hound? Yeah. I ah, because he's a dog! Uh, good point. Yeah. Oh, yes, crit! Sorry. Well done. I you destroyed that insect. <laughs> With a baseball bat. <laughs> I have the ability to do it, as uh, it would turn out. Yeah. Don't think I won't. <clears throat> well, let's get into Belch's base and then call this an episode well made. Okay. All right. <laughs> Handcrafted. This is an artisanally created episode for your enjoyment direct to you from our brain go away i don't what that guy was so far away over there (sighs) well that's annoying oh these fucking guys (laughs) there's the nose is a big part of it there's a really there's an artist who has done really cool drawings of characters from earthbound and monsters and stuff Mm -hmm. that they post on the subreddit and i love his putrid moldy man one (laughs) Oh. oh, his nose is just so phallic. Yeah, I guess. It's gross. It's putrid. It kind of, I mean, it, you, it, it looks more Muppety to me, like Gonzo or something. That's Yeah, but Gonzo's has more of a healthy curl to it, you know? Are you sure that a penis can't have a healthy curl? 
That's penis normalization. I won't stand for it. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many varieties no, of penis. penis. Is, you're, okay, fine. Fair enough. I'm sorry if I'm being unjust to penises. Winter penis is going to get their moment. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Largely ignored in society. <laughs> when can you just whip them out? Oh, Lord. Oh, my God. I'm obviously joking. <laughs> yes. Um, Giant disclaimer. Yeah. I know that we have to put those up sometimes. <laughs> we don't have to. I feel like people get that we're joking. And also, we're on YouTube. Those people are like gamer gators or whatever. Oh, so. Lord, yeah. <laughs> I just assume everyone I talk to is evil. <laughs> <laughs> Until proven otherwise. Not just on YouTube, just in my life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Anybody that you meet. it's That's a defense mechanism, I Probably, think. yeah. Well, we'll be back on the next episode. As I play dying. Mm.